Today is a big day for me. Um, I woke up this morning really, really excited. Uh, I've been waiting about a month for this, uh, and it's finally coming to fruition today. What's today? New truck day! Yeah, picking up my new truck. Um, should be here this afternoon, but we first thing, gotta get started with a uh, little breakfast, little coffee, and then hit the road. So mixed berries, we use strawberries, blueberries, blackberries. You need acai powder, which you can get on Amazon or at the grocery store. Uh, we like to use plain Greek yogurt, collagen peptides, honey, chia seeds, walnuts, and dark chocolate chips. in before uh, we pick up the truck and uh, got to run some errands too first what do we got to do Wally World Sally's Beauty Supply Target I'm gonna attempt coloring my own hair we'll see how that goes <laughs> that'll be an experiment yes it yeah pre-workout for the boys Blech. it's the most powdery pre-workout <coughs> so good that's awful. So good. Unlock the window. Never. He traps me in here, so I have to get pre-workout. <laughs> so our gym session got cut a little short. Yeah, got a uh, call pretty much as soon as I finished my warm up, and I think you just finished yours, yeah. uh, that the truck arrived. What time is it? Almost 12. Yeah, it arrived about six hours early, so. So, we're on the way yeah, to get the truck. It's both a blessing and a curse. Now we have to make up the workout on the back end. Um, probably gonna work out on the base. Honda Civic Type R. Squirrel. Squirrel, yeah. <laughs> uh, probably gonna work out on base, uh, rather than go to our little public gym. And uh, yeah, finish our workout after we pick up the truck. There it is. Holy cow. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it looks so good.
off-road location. Um, I think it's in the Pine State Park um, or State Forest, uh, just outside of Panama City. Uh, gonna hopefully get a little dirty, like it should be. Looks a little wrong if it's completely clean. <laughs> it does though, huh? So we are finally getting home, and uh, it's of course raining, but the truck is incredible. Um, it has been nothing but a joy off-road. Uh, finally got its, its little christening, its proper uh, dirtiness. Um, I'll take you a, a quick walk around of it before I head inside. You got the worn winch here. Uh, of course, I opted for the Duramax uh, Baby Max diesel. You got the snorkel, the KC light bar up top. You got 32 inch good wrench tires, uh, slide bar, and the roof rack up top. Uh, you'll see LEDs all around it, and I'll show you the custom. Uh, the custom buttoning on the inside. Uh, extra wide fender flares. Got a toolbox back here with an accompanied uh, cover. Rear bumper has some more lights in it as well as uh, some uh, frame tubing with the spare down there. I might relocate that, but we'll see. Um, yeah, and then I'll take you real quick inside. Pretty standard uh, GM interior. Pretty nice to be in here. Overall, just a generally good interior. Got the custom lights down here. Um, when you press them, they turn orange, saying that they're on. So far, so forth. They are very, very bright. So plans for the future. We are planning on having it as our tow behind rig. So we're going to stop by uh, Camping World to see about having a uh, the flat tow plate and um, the air brake system put onto it. That way we can flat tow it behind our RV so that we can take it with us on all of our adventures. We had originally planned on doing it with Liz's 4Runner, but come to find out, um, Toyota is not compatible with flat towing. Ended up trading my uh, Ford F350 for the Colorado ZR2 Bison. Um, pretty much dream truck material. The suspension system on it is incredible. The tires are incredible. The look is incredible. Um, 
can't wait to start taking it off-road and uh, start recording the adventures for you guys to see. Thanks for coming along.